Hello everyone, welcome to Tube Tech. So, in this video, we'll see how to create and manage organization wide team in Microsoft Teams. So, first of all, what is uh, organization wide team? A global administrator, uh, it, Microsoft Teams allows global administrators to create this uh, public group which pulls all the users in the organization and keeps the membership membership up to date with the active directory and update as users joins and leaves the organization which means when a global administrator creates this group everyone in the organization automatically joins this group and when a when a, mem when a member or user leaves the company this user also removes from this group and there are some restrictions with this group which is only global administrators can create this group and this group can be created only if an organization having users equal to 5000 users or less than 5000 users if your current for example if your organization is having more than 5000 users first you will not be able to create this you will not be able to create this uh, group there are also some there is also some limit of uh, five organization wide teams per tenant can be created a tenant can create only maximum up to five organization wide teams okay so let's see how to create that microsoft organization wide teams so in order to create navigate to the desktop by clicking on this accessing this link teams.microsoft.com click on teams in the join or create a team click on create team and then select build a team from scratch here we'll have an option to select org wide if an if our organization is less than 5000 users okay keep that in mind organization wide so by default it, it, this group will take our organization name if you want to modify you can also modify here it has taken the organization name as tube tech then click on create okay now you see on the left side pan now the group is created right so on the right side pan we have options to add more people create more channels if you have any frequently asking questions so all those options we have first we'll see uh, whether the as per the organization wide policy by default uh, all the users in the organization should be member of this group where to go and see so just click on this three dots more options click on manage team so if you see under members tab by default global administrator is a owner of this group by default all the administrators will be owner of this org wide group and all other users will be member of this group they will be assigned a member role for this group so i have created 21 users so all the users are added as a member of this group by default everyone joins joins this group there is no global administrator should join or something nothing like that everyone whoever joins the company by default they will be part of member of this group so this is the channel tab So this is the important tab settings you can manage this group 
click on team picture so you can upload your team picture here member permissions we have few options to modify the permissions for this groups guest permissions so allow guests to create and update channels by default the options are disabled at mentions choose who can use at teams at channel permissions so those things can be controlled here team code can generate a team code here so for this the team code is kga2f1i so using this team code also users can join the team so here there is a note guest won't be able to join with this team code allow emojis memes gifs and stickers so here is an option either you can allow or not allow by checking the checkbox and the next option is analytics so total 22 users 5 apps 1.4 mb is used good what are the apps forms one note planner price sharepoint so that is all the apps by default that we get it when you create a group fine what are the other options we have um, manage team add member add channel add member leave the team edit team get link to the team okay this is the link to the team you can also copy so administrators can also delete the team yes if you want you can delete the team so this is the procedures to create organization wide team in microsoft teams we'll see the next options other features of microsoft teams in the upcoming videos thank you